in the same way as people consider the emotional effects of lighting, they should consider the emotional effects of noise on them. I'm Gavin Quinn. I'm representing Ankura Quinn. Over time, people's rooms have become denuded of uh, many soft furnishings. Um, and also our ability to make noise through iPod speakers. Um, almost everything has a noise function now. That We're living in an environment whereby um, we are creating an awful lot of pollution with our environment that we don't even appreciate is there. We create acoustic wall panels, 100% wool felt, although we have also used other materials such as leather and linen, but the wool felt is particularly good. As you can see, they're 3D uh, designs. Um, they have astonishingly good acoustic properties. Uh, class A, uh, which is the highest rating you can get for these things, works in the most uh, absorption and diffusion basis and um, helps calm down rooms that are otherwise too noisy. My property secret is, or perhaps a bit of advice would be better, is to consider, in the same way as people consider the emotional effects of lighting, that they should consider the emotional effects of noise on them. Restaurants, uh, bars, etc., etc., you can hear everything and you can hear nothing. And as people raise their voices because they can't hear themselves think, people react badly to it. It sounds as though they're shouting, it sounds as though they're aggressive. By taking some of that out and placing yourself into a calm, more serene atmosphere, you create a calmer, more serene life for yourself.